we'll get started with some questions in the room. Can I please see a show of hands for those with questions? Sorry. Uh, listen, uh, the team was uh, quite confident coming into this match. I mean, uh, analyzing what actually, what actually went wrong for you in this game, today's game. I think we started really well. Uh, see uh, the drop catches. Uh, so I think that's the game change in this game. So Glenn Phillips went to score a hundred, uh, brilliant hundred. So I think it was the turning point in this game. But despite that, I mean, the casing about one sixty. Uh, probably... See, I think we could have kept them to like score like hundred thirty forty if we got that wicket. So yet again, uh, we didn't uh, back well in the upfront. So we know that. Uh, in these figures, so it's tough. The first two was going to be the toughest two overs. So uh, we were three down after two overs. So it 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 never going to help us when when we chasing 160. Um, how tough were the the batting conditions out there? Obviously, no no one was really able to get a a really big score, and besides Glenn Phillips, and I guess as a result, how good was Glenn Phillips's innings considering considering those conditions? Yeah, it was outstanding. Uh, in a uh, tough wicket, so uh, he he took a while to get settled in, and then uh, he he got his time, and there was a lot of time to hit hit to the ball i think he gave his time so that's where any of the other batsmen uh, were not good at have you watched many of the other matches here at sydney so far because it looked like slow bowling slow was a, a real key tactic for you early on yeah we never expected uh, to be slow like this this wicket so we expected to uh, be a better wicket than this but still uh, you know it happens uh, it might turn in some time with the conditions, uh, changing of conditions. So, yeah, it was the it was not the best cricket today, but still, yeah, good cricket to play cricket. And just the last one, um, you mentioned some of those fielding mistakes and, and drop catches. What's the key to to making sure they don't happen again in the next game? Uh, see, we no one wants to drop catches uh, when we play international cricket. So, uh, no, we don't need to point out anyone. Uh, and we don't want to blame anyone. What we need to do is to regroup in the next game and uh, come sharp uh, in the next two games, actually. Dasun, uh, you've had uh, six injuries so far in the tournament. How tough is it to lose uh, some of your top players and then to bring in replacements uh, from Colombo and even they break down? Uh, as captain, how tough has it been for you? Uh, yet again, it, it's uncontrollable uncontro so we can't expect uh, players to be fit and you know there there might be times that uh, more and more players will get injured so first we have to uh, check and see how how why why what's the reason behind that uh, the players getting injured so i don't have the control only what only the controllable thing is uh, when the players come to the field so i can get the ma maximum out of them so Apart from that, uh, it's a concern, but I don't uh, com uh, consider much on that. Do you still believe that uh, you got a chance to make it to the semifinals? Yeah, obviously. Yes. So next two games, if we can uh, get through uh, those two games and uh, especially the run rates uh, with the with a good run rate, uh, I think we got a uh, better chance to make it to the semis. Ashwin, just to follow on from what Vex was saying there, at times throughout this whole year, really, there have been moments where you've had big defeats and people have perhaps thought, can you bounce back from that? And you have done. You've obviously won the Asia Cup not too long ago. Does that give you confidence that you can still progress in this tournament, that you have a good performance even after a defeat like this one? Yeah, see, we have bounced back in the past. So uh, this, especially this young team, so uh, they have gone through lot of hard times uh, so i think uh, we still can uh, bounce back from this situation and uh, can manage to get to the semis and, and just on the start of your run chase when you lost a lot of early wickets to trent bolt and tim southy was there anything you could have done differently as a batting unit at that point just to try and give yourselves a foundation for that target yeah see it's always about playing straight uh, with the moving ball so we were not good at in this game so next game we are looking forward to do well. Uh, Dasun, uh, Apitakka, Pethumni Shankagi, Eudapandu, 
ඉලිහිමත් එක්ක මුළු කණ්ඩායමම නික කඩා වැටුණු ස්වරූපයක් දැක්කා මේ ඒ වගේ වෙලාවක ගොඩ ගන්න හැකියාව තියෙන නැත්ත නැත්ත ඒ කියන්නේ ඒක සෑහෙන මානසික බලපෑමක් කරා දෙයක් තව තුඩ පන්දුවකට වැඩිය මෙහෙමයි පැතුම් ගත්තාම දක්ෂ පන්දුරක් ඉන්නක ඉතින් ඔහු මම හිතන්නේ නැහැ මීට කලින් උඩ පන්දුවක් අත ඇරලා තියෙනවා කියලා ඉතින් මම වනිඳු පොඩ්ඩක් මොකද පහුගිය තාගේ හොඳින් පන්දුව වෙන්න නැහැ වෙච්ච ඉන්දා යාට පොඩි මේකත් තිබ්බ අප්සෙට් එක මම හිතන්නේ අනිත් ප්ලේයර්ස් ලට ඒක එච්චර මේ වුණා කියලා මොකද වැඩ ගත්තේ ඉන්නේ එතනින් එහාට හොඳ මැච් එකක් සෙල්ලම් කරන එක ඉතින් හැමෝටම වුණා වුනේ කඩු දවාගෙන තරඟයට අවතීර්ණ වෙන්න වාසනාවකට ඉතින් ඊට එහා අපිට ඕන දේ කරගන්න අමාරු වුණා නවසීලන්ත කණ්ඩායමේ පවර් ප්ලේ එක ඉවර වෙනකොට ලකුණු 26ට විකට් තුනක් වගේ ප්‍රමාණ ගිහිටි එතකොට අපෙක් මුලින් විකට් සහන අනමුත් ඇයි අපිට බැරි වුනේ ඒ විදිහට කැන්මේ කණ්ඩායමේ හැකියාවය ප්‍රශ්නය අන්දන මේ මානසිකත්වයේ ප්‍රශ්නය අද තියෙන මම හිතන්නේ හැකියාවයත් මානසිකත්වයත් ප්‍රශ්නය අන්නේ මේ දා දවසේ ක්‍රීඩා කරන විදිය මොකද ඇති වෙන්න මේ සිට්යුවේෂන් වල සෙල්ලම් කරලා තියෙනවා මම හිතන්නේ විකට් හතරක් ගියාමත් චාමිකයි බානුකයි සෙල්ලම් කරපු එකත් හොඳට රන්ස් ආව බෝඩ් එක අරගෙන මම හිතන්නේ චාමික වාසනාවන්ත වෙලා විදියට දැවි ගියා බවුන්ඩරි ලයින් එකේදී ඊට පස්සේ මම හිතන්නේ බානුකයි මා හිතන පාර්ට්නර්ෂිප් එකක් දැම්මා ඉතින් අපි දෙන්නට ඕනනේ ඕවර් 15ක් විතර නැන ගහන්න ඉතින් බානුකයෙන් පස්සේ වනිදු වෙන්නේ ඉතින් බානුකගේ දැවියාමත් එක්ක මම හිතන්නේ අපිට තිබ්බ අවස්ථාව ගොඩක් අඩු වුණා තරගේ නමුත් මම එක අන්තයක රැඳී හිටියා ඉතින් ආසනාන්තයේ දී ක්‍රීඩකයන් දිගේ දැවියාම පරාජයට හේතු වුණා Okay I don't think there are any more questions from in the floor so um we'll go to Zoom and Amitava please your question one question each please Yeah uh hi uh, hi dasun this is amitabha from preview india uh, i was talking about your batting uh, your batting uh, performances in this world cup so far not only in today's match also in the or maybe a match you lost in the earlier stage due to batting so is batting is a bigger problem for you than bowling at the moment uh see there's uh, nothing to be a problem when you play international cricket it happens you know uh, it's just a one game yeah namibia game it was a bad game for us but after that we played uh, good cricket in the tournament so uh, today's the uh, worst day uh, with batting i think it, it was the worst display with batting so what is important is to regroup as a batting unit and uh, do well in the next two games thank you okay next question umash please again one question each please guys umash no Okay Wahid All right uh, Shanka this is Wahid from Lahore Pakistan uh, first of all very hard luck for that match uh, if we talk about the Asia Cup uh, Sri Lanka start was not good but at the end uh, Sri Lanka won the tournament what do you think uh, still Sri Lankan cricket fan have a hope in the rest of the tournament thank you Yeah see uh, as i mentioned before so uh, we have gone through a lot, lot of tough times so we can i think we can still bounce back from this point Okay, great. I think that concludes this evening's press conference. Thanks very much, Dasan, for your time. Thank you. Thanks.